Okay, so any other time, if I didn't want my bulldog right beside me, it wouldn't, it would be running away, or if I did want it right beside me, it would be running down to the pond, but now that it's all soaking wet, it likes to sit right beside me. But what I'm going to do is when he disappears down there, I'm going to do the page or just to get him back, but I'm not going to, all right, what we're going to do, you guys, is my Kelly drawing thing. I'm sure I wanted to be an artist. I'm sure if we go back, I'm trying to... I was going to redo the one I had from the other day, though, you guys. I'll do a couple different colors here. Again, this, this uh, person is just uh, a composite of all of you. <laughs> You're unhappy. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> uh, you know, and the dog. This is your dog. You know, but the dog is, and there there are dogs that are just very insecure, that just cling to the people, but for the most part, again, this is the big wide world, the dog is doing everything in its power to go see what's in the big wide world. I mean, because that's what dogs do. We, on the other hand, are doing everything to desperately keep the dog, we're buying every different kind of collar and leash, and we're actually kidding ourselves that you could have it trained off the leash without electronic collars. I mean, it, it just isn't possible. And I mean, if somebody says it is, then my the only way that I would really believe it is if they just reenacted every one of my videos with this other method, you know, with the little chi chis and all this other stuff in the videos. Where's that dog chi chi? Did we get those people's number? All right, look, so mm -hmm. well, that's what you guys want to think of. There's going to be a zone right around you. This is where you've done all your damage with the dog. This is where you've pulled on the leash, and so now the dog is pulling. If this if this is the six-foot radius around you, it's it's done everything in its power to pull, pull, pull. And, and then if it got loose, it went way over here. So you've got to do a couple things. I mean, when it's on the leash, you do, do need to get let it to go out of that circle, and then you need to go that way. Let it go out to the end of that circle. You go that way. Not keep tug, 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 forcing it to try to stay with you. And then, really, when you're doing the collar, you've got to in initially add distance work. Wait until the dog is here. Drive it towards you. You back up. People don't want to do that. Remember, you guys, I talk about all the time, it's all about proximity. If we're going to just stand here and call the dog and stand right here, and, and that was the video we just did with the puppies. I'll try to upload this right after that. But I, they're here. I'm here. Now, by the time they get here, I'm way over here. I'm, I'm just only helping myself in every way possible. Now the circle's here. Now pretty soon, wherever the circle is, I'm at the center of it. Not, bye, bye. Not, this is your dog. Bye. See ya. See ya. See ya. Mm. Bye, guys. <laughs>